I'm trying to start some Fortnite starting with this classic. This is just level 1 out of 10, so let's make it harder. With a twist. Now with a double flip. We got it. We've got the Spidey landing emote for level 2. It's also called a backflip layout. For level 3, I'm trying the Capoeira emote. That was a scoot to cheat gainer with a Capoeira move before. Let's try it. That was way too easy, so we're gonna add in the challenge cube. Whatever option it lands on is the challenge I have to add to the flip. Oh no, blindfolded. This is a little scary. Yes! What? Level 4 is the flash kick from Street Fighter. If you look at it closely, he actually puts his foot on something, so it's obvious to me that it's gonna be a wall flip with the flash kick. Let's kick it up a notch by adding a twist. Close. Yes! On to the next one. We got the slash and smash emote for level five. That move was a corkscrew, but with a smash at the end, so let's give it a try. That was first try, so chance cube round two. Oh, is that even possible? To still be able to smash, I tied my hands in front of my body. <laughs> Challenge completed. The emote for level six is called Spring Loaded. Since they do all their backhand springs on the spot, I'm gonna see how many I can do while staying on the air floor. Ah, oh, not bad, but we can do more. Yes, we got it! Now let's see how many I can do with more space. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven. Oh, woo, woo. I had to stop because of the wall, but we got double digits! <sighs> the next emo at level seven is Survivor Salt. It's basically a one-handed Superman push-up into a Webster, which I've never done before, so wish me luck. <laughs> what did I do? What? I wasn't sure if I was gonna get that. I guess it's time to make it harder. <laughs> Yes! Time for the next level. Level eight is the emote called Aracrobatics. It's basically a round off into a back handspring step out, into a back flip with a half twist. Now, let's put them all together. Oh, oh my gosh, I don't even know what happened. Since the emotes loop, let's try two in a row. <laughs> yes! Once again, it's time to make it harder. Oh, this one already has a half twist, so now that means I have to do a one and a half twist. Woo! Challenge complete! 
did. I think that was two twists. <laughs> For level nine, we got the first non-emote of the video and it's Miles doing a huge gainer off a building. Let's start with this drop. Now one block. Now two blocks. Three blocks, now this is high. Before we move on to the final level of this video, here's a few extra emotes that didn't make my top 10. We've got the power punch. And now, Widow's Pirouette. The Blanca backflip. The cat flip. Now we're flipping away. This one is cartwheeling. Here we are, level 10, the hardest emote of this video, and it's called Evasive Maneuvers. This one's the hardest because it's the first emote with four different tricks. The first one's a dive roll. Number two is called a front handspring. Third one's a cartwheel. The last one's called a front aerial, and it's the hardest one because they're in a full splits, and as you can see, I don't have the full splits. Instead, I'm gonna do a parkour trick called the Webster, which is also a front flip with the legs separated. Now, let's put all four tricks together to do evasive maneuvers. <laughs> so close! <laughs> nope. Ah, too far! What? Ah, I need more room. Ah, oh, what? Ah. Yes, we got it, level 10. Thanks for watching. Make sure you check out this video next and click here to subscribe for more. As usual, I'll catch you guys on the flip side.